Alright, we're checking out the only game where the entire purpose is to ruin the life of your unborn child by going through life making the worst decisions humanly possible. It's Save the Baby. Obviously, the game Save the Baby starts as all games of pregnancy do, with you in the club partying it up. When all of a sudden you feel sick, what should you do? Visit a doctor or keep headbanging and chugging pills? Anna? I'm so sorry that it's me. So it's the next day and finally she has to go see the doctor. How do I get there? Take a cab or run? I don't know. I mean, cardio isn't always a bad thing. I'm not sure I'll make it to the hospital in one piece. What kind of neighborhood does this girl live in? I mean, we're there. The ch There's not much left of the child. It kind of looks like a deformed lima bean. What should I do? Find a father raise the kid alone. What, like any father? Do we have no idea who it could have been? Anna, seriously, your child looks like a phone. Like this is the receiver, here's the cord. You know what, why not? We'll find a father, let's just pick one at random. Who can the father be? Get a DNA test, ask my friend. Oh, we going on Maury. All right, it, are, the, are the results in? Where do I get the DNA test? Buy it in a pharmacy, order it online. Legit, Amazon has everything. We're getting, this one has good reviews, plus it's cheap. I need samples of a potential father's for DNA. Who is it? My friend's boyfriend, my ex-boyfriend. You know what, let's really get this kid's future screwed up. My friend's boyfriend. It's Steve, we drank too much wine that one night. Hi, Steve. What do I talk about? Talk about the weather, get to the point. Yeah, no beating around the bush. Considering we got the paternity test on Amazon, it's probably already at the front door. He's freaking out, what do I do? Screw him or calm him down and get some samples. I changed my mind, Steve. My child is not gonna have a loser for a father. Get out. I'm sure there will be hairs around afterward to test DNA. I didn't even need him to come over. <laughs> My friends want to go out and party with me. Time to get back out there and bathe in ecstasy. The baby is going to have a great sense of rhythm. I see that guy's eyes on me. Completely apathetic look. Dragon t-shirt. Looks like a potential father. All right, go over, introduce yourself. Listen, I'm collecting as much DNA as humanly possible. He wants to keep hanging out. Go to his place, invite him to your place. This game is really good at making me a terrible parent. We're going to his place. Thanks again for inviting me. I'm not drunk. I'm just intoxicated by you. Haha, <laughs> you mean, no, I think you're drunk. Look, we're really close to having a Dragon Age playing father. Just keep bullshitting him. All right, at this point, Dragon Age man has moved in with me. I don't know if he knows I'm pregnant, but it really doesn't matter because he's already offering me alcohol. Absolutely. I need some relaxing. We could spend the night together. What should we do? <laughs> pregnant. Actually, I feel like if the game allows me to do this, then maybe we can really keep him around. At least I'll know he's not the father. This has been great. Wait, is that a ring on his finger? <laughs> Ask about the ring. Anna? Pretend you didn't see it. I want to get more serious. I should ask if he wants kids what his life plans are. Well, I might as well ask this, but he really doesn't have a choice. Never liked kids. <laughs> oh boy. Oh no. I left a pregnancy test out and he's looking at it. Tell him it's his baby. I mean, we've lied about everything else here. Wait. The date from this is before we met. I can't believe- Oh, crap! Well, there goes that relationship. Finally, the DNA test came back. Negative, so it wasn't Steve. Who should I contact? Now, Steve's father! The plot thickens. A lot. Why not? The elevator got so steamy, I'll call Jim. What the hell have you been doing, Anna? It's his voicemail. What should I say? It's urgent. It's been a few days and he hasn't responded. Call him again, send him some photos. He doesn't really say what kind, but you know what? This should get his attention. Jim got back to me. He wants to meet. Get together ASAP. Park down the road. Should be easy to get to. Jim, you better be the father. I'm running out of people. So, uh, how's your wife doing? She's my ex-wife, actually. Bingo. Okay, maybe he's looking for a new family. How should I get his DNA? Run your hands through his hair. 
Steal the straw from the drink. This one seems more scummy, so we're gonna take his straw. It's sort of like recycling. Tim has called me 10 times in the last three days. Ghost of the pathetic divorcee. God, she's vicious. But yes, he wants one more date. Make him beg for it. I need to buy time for the DNA test anyway. I keep seeing his ex-wife's texting notifications. Ask why he's still talking. Or look at his phone when he leaves it out. This is literally gonna be the second phone that I've looked through. He's still married. You lying son of a bitch. And I don't feel so bad anymore. The divorce paperwork is taking a long time. She wants half my money. You might need that money to start a new family. Yeah, you're right. Oh, I can't believe this is working. I'm meeting my wife to tell her my decision. I want you to join me. This is about to get real weird. Hi. Hi, Mary. As you can see, I've met someone new. I don't even, at this point, I don't even, th the relationships have gotten so screwed up. I don't know where to go. Welcome to my home. Why don't you come inside, Mary? Now we're all in the car together? Were you fooling around with her while we were together? Answer me. Tuck and roll. <laughs> Yeet. A few seconds later. So we're in the hospital now <laughs> the child gets some acrobatics how long was I knocked out two weeks oh my god on the plus side the pregnancy is moving along quite fast do you have any questions what happened to Jim and Mary oh the couple that brought you in they left together are you serious I'm the one supposed to be screwing up relationships I brought them back together the vehicle you were in Hit a tree. Wow, I just screwed everyone's life up. Anything else? How injured were they? Oh, <laughs> let's not care about the injuries. How close did they seem? They were very cute. They were talking to each other a lot. It's not fair. It's just because I was in a coma. Is there anything I can get you? Yes. Painkillers. The hospital bill is insane. Find Jim and force him to pay it off. Find Mary and sue her. This entire game is like one gigantic Jerry Seinfeld episode. Absolutely. Hey, it's Jim and Mary. We realized life is too short, so we're going to work things out. Oh, hell no. I want my money. All right, over at the house, he left the door unlocked. Sneak inside. Okay, we snuck inside of the house. Is that sound what I think it is? Oh no. Oh God. I've got to do it. I'll catch them in the act. The act, like what? <laughs> They're married, technically. You're out of the hospital. I didn't know if you would recover. So you just let me there. <laughs> I'm back, so let's get out of here. Listen, I'm still looking for a father. And right now you're the only option. Let's go. Come back to bed, Jim. I'm not done with you. If she wants to watch. Ah! I don't know what to say. How about an apology? Sorry. You're the latecomer here. Get lost. Slap her or glare at her. Go in for the right cross. Oh, Mary grabs your hand and pushes you over. You two get in a fight. Stop it, you two. You know what? Slap him too. I'm losing control over the situation. What should I jump in bed and take control? Go out and have a drink. Both of these are terrible. I mean, I guess I'll do this one. I don't even know how to express how weird that entire- I don't remember what happened last night. I do. Investigate the room. Check my phone messages. There's probably all kinds of DNA in the room. Aha! Who is in the shower? Wait, am I still at their house? Ah, eh, whatever. Just walk around like you own the place. Hi, Jim. Good morning, sleepyhead. Get out. I mean, I guess I'm hungry. <laughs> Mary and I are planning on a trip. Wait, so you're leaving me again? Don't cry. I will give you a call when you- re I will give you a call- when you return. Wait, is this Google Translate's fault or is he screwing me over with semantics? There's a receipt sticking out of his pocket. Trip him as he leaves and grab it when you help him up. Yeah, why not? Two first class tickets to Mexico. <laughs> He's leaving the country with his wife to get away from me. I was always paying for food on our dates. Wait a second. He took the money under my mattress. Chase the cheating thief to Mexico. Holy crap, things are getting nuts. Call him. Absolutely not. We're going to Mexico. That's it. I'm going down there. What should I pack? Pack for a long trip. Pack your daddy's weapon. Guns. He always said, be more dangerous than the place you're going. This girl's father's amazing. All right, no problem. Just got to call my arms dealer. No time to get a license. Order online illegally, go to a gun show. I've bought my pregnancy test online, might as well buy this. Delivery pickup is in an alleyway. Seems legit. Oh yeah, this guy is totally legit. What kind do you want? The biggest available. I have just the thing. 
I love how the gun is just like poltergeisting in front of the shot every once in a while. Perfect. Now I have to just find something to hide it in. Hide it under the back seat. Hide it in your suitcase. I mean, I would keep it close. I should ask someone to take care of my blaze while I'm gone. Ask your neighbor. The internet has literally done everything for me at this point. Might as well just keep this train rolling. This girl Shauna is cheap. Plus she's kind of cute. I love how she's not even trying to wear a seatbelt or anything. A gas station just in time. We're running low. Going to debt. Siphon gas from other cars. Add it to the list of crimes. Oh, I got a call from Shanna. The DNA test for Jim showed up. This will only complicate things. That's what this game does. Call her back. What an interesting result. 50 bucks or I burn the test. Are you serious? This girl has no decent people in her life. I mean, to be fair, like she's not a decent person either. I don't want to burn it though. I really want to know who it is. You hear that? I just lit the match. I changed my entire outfit. I changed my hair too. I got so angry. I went into like Super Saiyan. I can't let her ruin anything else. Call the cops, call the neighbors. What am I going to call the neighbors on the other side of my house? She's bad enough. Honestly, maybe they'll just kill each other. What did she do? I'm on vacation and my house sitter burned my pregnancy test some marijuana. Yeah, why not? Wow, that's terrible. I knew that's all they would care about. The hell? Sorry, ma'am. The border is closed due to gang activity. Is this a gang member? Hey there, I know a back way across the border, but you'll have to drive. Absolutely. I'll hook you up with whatever you need in Mexico. Oh, welcome party. Keep your head down, miss. Were those bullets? Try to push him out of the car. Honestly, he called me miss. He's probably like the nicest guy I've met yet. I can't die here. Head down, wheel straight. They're getting closer. Weave through some to yell at the guy. You know what? Why not? Stop shooting at me. We can handle this bull's gun out of the back seat. Keep her steady. Can I get a gun too? No can do, miss. You're doing great. Come on, that's my gun. Been a pleasure, but this is where you get off. Kick. Grab my wallet. Grab the baby bottle. These are the two things that I can. Oh, the baby's not even born yet. Don't worry, miss. I'll come back for you. You liar. I hope he gets shot. Not one good man on this earth. Look for civilization, look for water. Honestly, civilization has been kicking me while I'm down. Let's just look for water. A bunny. It looks so edible. Ah, rooted rabbit, eat it. <laughs> yum, 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 yum. Okay, I think I finally found a town. Approach carefully. I still don't have my gun. Oh, it's the police. Is that the car I was in? I hear you. Come out with your hands up. I mean, do I do it or just run from the Mexican police? I feel like I should just run. I hate it when they run. Look, give me a break, man. I've had a really bad, like, lot of days. Camera at the border saw you driving it. Come with me. God damn it. Wonderful. Now I'm in Mexican prison. How did it come to this? I get one, one phone call. Call mom, call a lawyer. You always call the lawyer. Okay, the lawyer can't do crap. I need to find my own way. Test the bars on the window. Check the hallway for keys. We're doing this Looney Tunes style. Wait, is that a truck driving straight at the prison? What the hell? Oh my God. Conrad never leaves a friend behind. Is this the dude that kicked me out of the car? Oh, he did come back for me. Shut up and move over. I'm driving. Conrad. I thought you were a scum-sucking piece of garbage, but you pulled through. I don't really want to know how you got this truck. We need to get you back to the US. What brought you to Mexico? Chasing a man, revenge, hatred. All things I've given Kent to leave on the side of the border. Well, I hope they get what's coming to them. Oh, Conrad, they will. What's the guy's name? Oh, I'm telling you everything about him. That helps me narrow it down. Maybe I'll pay them a visit. That would be great. Bye, Conrad. Let me know if you find Jim. I love how he just left me with this truck. What the hell happened to my house while I was gone? Shauna is going to pay for wrecking my house and burning that test. What would Conrad do? I think we both know the answer to that. I have a security camera in the house. Are those drugs she's using? Call her and put on the pressure. Send a clip of the video to her. Mm. Hey there, saw your message and came right over. You could go to jail. 500 bucks and I might let this blow over. I kind of wonder if I can extort her for more. Please don't, we can work this out. I didn't destroy the test. You can have it if I can have that tape. Deal, but ask me on your knees, God. All right. Who's the father? Jim is the father. Oh God. Make all the copies. I got a call from Jim. What a surprise. Oh boy. 
He must be panicking. You're crazy. There's no way I'm never coming back. I wonder how Conrad is doing. <laughs> Jim might have a surprise visitor soon. There's a man here and you're listed as an emergency contact. Who? Oh, all the men I know ran to Mexico. I'll be right there. I hope Conrad didn't rough him up too. Oh, Conrad did get to him. Hey, Jim. Good to see you. It's been so Punch him in the face. Yeah. <laughs> He had some memory loss. Please don't hurt the patient. Good, then he won't remember me punching him in the face. I don't remember a thing. You've got a lot to answer for. My lawyer will be in touch. Okay, so now we're in court. I don't remember a thing. I have all the evidence, Jim. This is some convincing materials. I need something else to convince this judge. Call Mary. Yeah, her and I aren't on really good terms. Get your lawyer to call. I mean, I've been in contact with a lawyer the whole time, so why not? Oh, this this is about Jim, huh? You can keep him. I don't want him. I want him arrested. He treated us both horribly. We both deserve better. As long as I get my money, I really don't care. So yeah, let's do this. I hate you, but Jim was worth. <laughs> let's destroy him. Women are working together just to destroy the husband. Jim, you're found guilty. How much money will you need to, ch to raise the child? 10,000 a month, yeet! So be it! Chilling in my bathtub, making 120 grand a year now. What do I do with this truck? I love that I'm just keeping it. Like, who, where, like whose is it? It came from Mexico. We don't even know where the driver is. I guess we'll just pimp it out. Feels great to have money, 10 grand a month. I need new clothes. Fancy underwear. The best exercise happens in bed. Okay, things are getting serious now. These cramps are really speeding up. Go to the hospital. Ah, just tough it out. You've been through a lot, Anna. Never mind. Now she's on the ground. I can hardly move, but I need to get out of here. Call an ambulance. Now take the big ass truck. Okay, I guess I made it. Please sit back down. I'll call you when we're ready. I'm like 30 months pregnant. Give me a break. Am I finally going to have the child? I've been through so much. I don't even know what to say at this point. Not sure if I'll be able to do this. Should I take painkillers? I mean, we've already taken him with the child. Why not? Oh, I think it actually worked. Am I finally a mother? Congratulations, it's a healthy baby boy. Yay, I did it. Is there a father I should call? I don't need him and neither will my baby because I've got 10 grand a month from him. Now I get to name the child. It's more of a question considering what I just went through to get this, but we're doing it. I'm not really sure how, but we managed to save the baby. Anyway, folks, hope you enjoyed this episode. Till next time, stay foxy, much love.